All right, folks, I am making some Budwig muesli. And um, I like it with the tablespoon of honey. So I have my nice, helps to have a big wide mouth container, your tablespoon, high quality cottage cheese from cows that ate grass on pasture, your immersion blender, handheld blender, one minute only. You don't want to overdo it. So I am going to take six tablespoons of cottage cheese. I'm going to go ahead and stir this one. One, two, three, four, five, and six. And then uh, three tablespoons of cold pressed flaxseed oil. You want it from the refrigerator section at the health food store. And um, three tablespoons. One, two, Now, after this is all mixed up nicely for one minute, then you grind the flaxseed and add the ground flaxseed. So, um, I'll just let you hang in here for the minute while I do this. You may want to mute it or something. I'm not sure. Let me get a wait. Set my spoon. All right. So you know it's very oily on top. We're gonna blend it in. It's gonna look like mayo or something. Set it down there in the bottom and just turn it on. about right. See, there should be no more oil sitting in there. It should be all nice and creamy and blended in. You don't want to overdo it though. I usually set a timer and then it takes a while for me to get all of this off of here without a proper spatula at the moment. They're all dirty. <laughs> When you grind the flax seed, you want to use a coffee grinder of some sort. And um, you do not grind that for a whole minute, just until it's ground.
I just go ahead and eat it out of here after I put my uh, honey and flax seed in there? See that? Nice and creamy, thick. It's actually really yummy. Just plain. For those of you that like cottage cheese, just has a little tiny flax flavor. All right. Um, grinding the flax seed is kind of tricky because my machine, you have to hold the cord in. We'll see. I'll, I'll bring you along. You've been with me this far, so let's see what we can do with the video. And All right. Here's my flax seed. I got it at uh, Winco in the Whole Foods, uh, the bin bulk section. All right, let me see, it was two. Oh yeah, my two tablespoons. I store this in the refrigerator. All right, my grinder doesn't work when you hold down the lid. I gotta push this little button. I mean, my hold the sword in. All right, it's working. Now it's not. <laughs> Check on it. Ground flax seed needs to be eaten within um, 15, 20 minutes or because it starts going rancid really quickly. Okay, I'm gonna try this a little bit more. Grind it a little bit more. Be careful, don't take the lid off too soon or you throw it everywhere. All right, that looks good. Now I can, this thing's designed, you can turn it over and. Add this. Beautifulness. That ground flex. a lot but hey that's what we need all right and then we're gonna put this right into here the muse now it's more like a muesli sorry I'm a little shaky I need to eat probably all right A tablespoon of honey, and I'm good. If you're gonna use honey, any honey, if you ever use honey, use good, high quality, raw honey. All right, well, I'm just gonna guess about a tablespoon. Oh, I got it on my shirt, didn't I? ready for my first meal of the day. I've been doing intermittent fasting. I usually don't eat until after two o'clock in the afternoon. And uh, just started doing this budwig stuff. Um, this is probably, I've only had the, the proper blender for a couple days. So this is like my third day. Mixing it with the regular, regular hand mixer or hand by hand doesn't blend it properly to get the sulfur and stuff to do their chemical reaction. Anyways, this is beautiful. Um,
delicious, highly nutritious, even though I don't believe in milking cows and all that stuff, unless you're doing it properly on a homestead with cows that eat grass. Um, this is something that my body needs. The proteins, the uh, cottage cheese has every amino acid in it. And then when you do this flax health edition, um, there's just uh, Joanna Budwig, you know, she was nominated for seven Nobel Prizes and she found that this really helped the cells get the nutrition into the cells. So, um, cheers. Mm. It gets that nutty crunch, in, not crunch, but chewiness of seeds. Um, I like it. Some people may not, but it's my medicine and it's delicious and it's highly nutritious. Cheers.